Simply Applique has an easy way to convert an FCM file into an applique. The first thing we'll do is at the Scan and Cut machine. We'll choose the pattern and choose the second menu. Choose a sub-menu with the baseball mitt and in there there's a sewing machine. Select the sewing machine and press OK. Press the first part, press OK and then press Set. Choose Add, select the second part, press OK and press Set. Now we're going to save this to our Scan and Cut Canvas since this is a wireless model. If you don't have a wireless model, press the USB. Once you press Scan and Cut Canvas, it will automatically save to your canvas and you can press OK. Since we're already at the machine, let's go ahead and cut our pieces. I've got my fabric arranged on my mat, so I'm going to press the Background Scan button and start. The background will scan and will appear on my screen. Now that the background is there, I'm going to move the pieces around and arrange them on my fabric. Press OK and press Cut. Press Start and my machine will cut my fabric. Since we placed both of the pieces of the sewing machine on the screen at the same time, we may press Finish because we don't need to cut any more pieces. We'll be back at the Cut screen and you'll see that my pieces have been cut. Now that we're done at the Scan and Cut machine, let's log into our Scan and Cut canvas and click on My Projects. There you'll see the Scan and Cut sewing machine that we saved to our Scan and Cut cloud. We'll click on the Download button to download this to our computer. Once you select Download, choose Download to PC and choose the location to save the file. Close the menu. Let's click on Simply Applique. Go to the File pull-down menu, choose Import FCM. Locate the FCM file that we just downloaded and select Open. The FCM file will appear on the screen. Let's assemble the sewing machine. Click off the sewing machine, click on the base and move it beneath the sewing machine. To align it, we need to select everything, so select Tool, select All, go to the Arrange tab, and choose Horizontal Center. Click on the Tools tab and choose Convert to Applique. We now have an applique sewing machine. We can do a little refining here, so let's zoom in and see where we need to refine it. You'll notice that there's extra stitches that are there where the sewing machine and the base meet. Let's click on the Select tool and then zoom out. Right mouse click on the sewing machine base and choose Remove Overlap Stitches to get rid of the excess stitches. Choose OK and your overlap will be removed. I've moved away the base so that you can see it. Let's click Undo and get started again. Go to the File pull-down menu and choose Save As. Name the design and save it in your machine format to a USB stick to take to your machine. At the embroidery machine, we're going to press Embroidery, locate our design on the USB stick, and press Set. Press Embroidery, and we're ready to stitch. The first piece will be the placement stitch for the main part of the sewing machine. Put the hoop into the machine, and we're ready to start stitching. After the placement stitch for the sewing machine has stitched, Place the fabric that we cut at the Scan and Cut machine on top of those stitches. Make sure that your sewing machine is in place in the appropriate spot. Smooth it out if necessary. If you need to, press it with an iron. The tack down stitch and covering stitches will embroider. After that, the placement stitch for the base will embroider. After the placement stitches are finished, place the fabric down on top, smooth it out, and complete your embroidery project.